The Forest for me and many others was a beautiful yet brutal survival game that kept you on your toes from start to finish. Falling out of the sky and trying to figure out why some half naked child snatcher just yoinked your kid. Oh, hello there. Um, excuse me, could you not? Is a great way to introduce you to the dodgy world in play. From here on out, you follow a breadcrumb trail of pages and puzzles all the way to its gripping finale. That I won't spoil, but it's definitely not one I expected for sure. With the whole game being able to play it in co-op, adding a friend into the action was just pure bliss as I do love me some good old co-op fun. Playing house, eating flesh, mmm, delicious. Exploring caves and blowing up cannibals. It's fair to say, do love me some forest. And in my humble opinion, I would call it good times. All caps. Not just the regular old good times, like the kind you half-heartedly tell people, oh yeah, that was a good time, but more like the kind of fun where you want more, like you demand to have more of that fun, like your heart yearns for that joy to return into your life to set a standard of enjoyment once more because all these bland ass boring games got you jumping through hoops like a dolphin trapped in a cage only to get no reward for your heart. <clears throat> Anyways, what I'm trying to say in the longest way possible is, let's get hyped for some Sons of the Forest. And although it has been delayed, again, with the new current release date being February the 23rd, 20, 23, damn, time really does fly. I believe this is what's best for the Forest sequel, because unlike most of you, I enjoy my games to be released when they are complete rather than screaming at the devs for delaying a game, only to scream at them once more because they've just released an unfinished buggy mess, because that's just uncivilized. Along with the delay, we also get a bit more footage of what's to come, and oh boy, they just keep pulling me in. Logs in a river floating downstream. Other than the logs, we get some bow gameplay, more mutant dudes, and um, I, I don't even know what I'm looking at here. Long story short, Sons of the Forest is going to be insane. More guns, more creepy dudes. Like for reals, I don't even know what this is. I, I don't even, I can't even, but I like it. More eating of the wildlife. And between you and me, I can't wait to play some role play with some free-legged mutant babe. Ah, uh, this game is going to be great. So unfortunately, like I said, Delayed, not the first time, might not be the last. Mentally, I've been playing this game since May this year, before its first delay. And because of this, I do cry a little bit each night. So if you haven't already, go and give the forest a blast. I know I'm ready to have another ride of that plane before Sons of the Forest comes out. Because god damn, I just love watching my son's receding hairline in VR. Oh hello, you ugly little bastard i'm monkey may cry this has been monkey may cry tv don't forget to drop a like sub subscribe uh, all that other jazz that people do and as i always say the best defense is a good defense or, or run away you, you can't attack what you can't catch peace